Well, hi guys, welcome back to another video. And today I'm just going for a little walk in the woods. I'm going to do a bit of bushcraft cooking. I've got some sausages in my backpack. I've got my friend with me, my friend Danny. He's there, he's uh, mushroom foraging. So he's going to teach me a little bit about mushroom foraging. So we're going to go and do a little bit of that. And I've got the Firebox Nano with me. So I thought what we do is we'll find somewhere nice to sit down, chill out, cook some sausages, have a cup of tea, and he's gonna teach me about some mushrooms. So let's go. We're gonna have a, a little look down here to see what we can find. And he's hopeful that we're gonna find some mushrooms. Right, what have we found? So we've got a baby shaggy ink cap. Uh, just there, which you won't pick. We'll leave that to keep growing. There's another one just here. Ouch, I sting that uh, Yeah, and when they grow older, when they reach maturity, they'll just be big shaggy cones. It just drip off into that black ink. I think we're looking for magic mushrooms. <laughs> are we looking for magic mushrooms, are we, Danny? No, we're looking for all sorts. Actually. <laughs> I don't want any magic mushrooms. I'm not up for a trip today. This is enough of a, oh, this is no, this no. is enough of a trip for me. What we found then? Birch snipe. Okay, birch snipe. We found a birch snipe, and is that that's, mm -hmm. uh, is that a poisonous one? That is a poisonous one. That will cause well, gastrointestinitis be... and uh, give you a very very bad belly. So yeah. So we won't be eating that then. We'll we stick to the sausages, that. shall it we? Look, it looks nice. <laughs> yeah, well, sausages and a cup of tea. We've got some edibles, have we? We found something, and uh, let's have a little look at what these are. Right, these are these are what called puff 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 balls. Balls. Right? Yeah, these are puff balls. So you've got them all growing all around here. There's quite a healthy amount of them. That's that. That's the bullet growing in between them. A what? A bullet. This nice red stem. These these are edible. Oh, they're edible as well. Yeah. So basically, yeah, we'll just take one of these out. And then, as you see, different from the earth balls, these ones are white in the middle. Ah, oh, yeah, I see, yeah. These are actually good for eating, and these, these are a good age. So, oh, okay. I mean, if you actually, do you want me to pick them for you? You can do. And then, if you, if, I mean, if you're gonna eat them, you can, obviously you can ID them and stuff, but we'll leave the young ones. There you go. Ah, cool. <laughs> Doing a bit of bushwhacking now. Looks like we're cutting our own trail through here then. Probably the best bits are uh, all the up with trees. With all these little trees that are growing, they've all got moss on the stumps. Yeah, these. Yeah, isn't they interesting? Like the little ones as well. Yeah. Like the bonsai. Yeah, like these little ones here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Interesting, very interesting. Right, we found some interesting looking mushrooms. Anything, he's not sure what they are though. So we won't be picking those. We're trying to find a little spot to, to sit down and cook and have a cup of tea because I'm getting hungry now and uh, I want a cup of tea as well. Is it looking any good up here? Yeah, Is this our little spot, is it? Yeah. This is our spot here. That's a chair for you. Thank you. A stool, should I say? A 
still for me. Got some award winning sausages. Some water for a cup of tea, and I've got the Firebox Nano. You've probably seen in previous videos. So we're going to get this set up and get a little fire going. Do you have to make charcoal and stuff like that? Well, I've not made any. I think I've got stuff to You've got if some, you have you? No, I haven't got any, but if you get decent fire going, I can make some. That'll be good. It'll be good if we can get some charcoal off made. Okay. So what's that you light in there? Well, it's St. Alfred's tea cake. St. Alfred's tea cake? Yeah. And it should. As you get it going, <laughs> he says. Got it? See it burning? Are you rolling it? Right then, so. Now I'm going to pop that in here. Yeah, just pop it in there, look. Leave that flat, get that nice and flat. It's going though. It's a shame it's rained. Yeah, it's a bit damp some of this, but yeah, stuff on the top's quite dry. <laughs> and I did bring her back up. There's a striker. So, so we've got it going. That's has to be the knife. No. Me eye. <laughs> it's been a bit yeah, of a yeah. challenge get this lit, getting this lit, hasn't it? <laughs> we're gonna we're gonna try and dry some pine cones next to the fire once it's going. So we've got a little bit of fuel for it. I'll show, I'll show you how to it's actually it's Finally got it going though. So we might get these sausages cooked after all.
one to get the pan on. Get the pan heated up so we can get some of these sausages on. And that's nice and hot now. Looking all right. Yeah. I don't know how many sausages we're going to get on. How many sausages do you want? I'll take two. Right. Well, I've got eight. <laughs> you want two? I'll take two, three. There we go. So let me put another one on then. I'll squeeze another one on there. Because they will shrivel up a little bit. There we go. Feed the little bits of the little twigs in the little hole there. Yeah, they're cooking nicely now. They're not looking too bad, are they? I would say they're about ready. So we're gonna we're gonna have them sausages, and then we're gonna put some water on to make a cup yep. of tea. Should be enough for a cup of tea for the two of us. I've got to turn these legs in now though, this is the only thing. This is the difficult part. It's easier that, isn't it? I think. That's better. There we go. Let's get these sausages eaten. Let's try these sausages then. Award award winning sausages. Mm. Got a Moroccan vibe. Got Mediterranean vegetables in, apparently. And you can taste it, it's actually really good, they do. Mm. Wishing the cup of tea was ready though. We'll leave that for three to five minutes to brew. Right, we finally got the cup of tea done. Took a little while to boil the water because it is a little bit of a, it is a small stove as you can see. And it, um, yeah, it burns through the, the fuel pretty quick. So you've constantly got to keep filling up with wood. But yeah, it was good. It was nice to, nice to use it and I really enjoyed it. So yeah, cheers. I think that is a good time to end the video. 
Hopefully you enjoyed it. If you did, give me a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and hopefully I can do some more of these type of videos because I've really enjoyed coming out here and just sitting out and enjoying some nature. So I'll see you on the next one, guys. See you later. Bye.